nightmares in my head I fear that the thoughts build up until I hear That my mind fills up into a creature And it haunts me somewhere much deeper Me, Jeon Jungkook, into the presence of this rain And in the fire which is burning in my heart For you, I take you as my wife I promise that my loyalty will always belong to you And your every single breath is belong to Jeon Jungkook I am taking you as my wife. Tears roll down from your cheek and he press his lips into yours and kiss you passionately. After a few seconds, he was kissing you very aggressively and his hand was traveling around your back. He bite your lower lips to give you a sign to kiss him back but tear was flowing down from your eyes. He was torturing your lips with his mouth. He suddenly listened a voice of wood temperature coming toward them. He quickly break the kiss and take out the gun and point it toward the man which was about to shoot him. He placed his one hand on your waist and attach your small figure with him. You close your eyes tightly and hug him and he shoved the man in just three fire. You were still hugging him tightly because you're afraid from all of this fight. He smirked after killing this man and looked toward you who was still attached to his body. He put his gun back and touch your face. You quickly open your eyes and take one step back. But he hold your waist and again touch your small figure with him and leave no space and touch your lips. Jungkook, I never knew you will taste that much good. I want it more from you. My expectations toward you is rising, my wife. You frown your brows and look down. Why, you please, can you just stop talking rubbish? We are into the middle of the jungle and we need to find a place for ourselves. Otherwise, I will be get fever. I am totally wet from head to toe. He room his eyes toward your small figure. Jungkook, you are my wife for now. So now I'll take care of you and you don't know. I have not a ways to know how to lose someone's body temperature. He watch you from head to toe and you make a disgusted face and walk toward other side. Jungkook, this girl will never learn how to behave in front of his husband. He smirk and into the other side you are taking long steps so he can't come near to you. But he know it very well. Jungkook, if you are trying to running away from me so I'll tell you one thing. It never worked because I know how to find my bird very well. You turn and look toward him. Why, Yoon? I know it better. You can found me, and only death can give me a piece from the headache like you. He smirk on your word, and you again walking toward your path. Jungkook, oof, this anger making me more crazy for you, my wife. He mumbled, but you did not pay any attention to his word. He mumbled and start following you. Soon your eyes landed on the house which was into the middle of the jungle. You quickly run toward it. Jungkook, where are you running bird? Why you follow me? JK, hey, I'm a man and I never follow a girl. He hold your wrist and make you walk behind him. You tap your feet into the floor because of anger. Why you sometimes I wish to take this gun and shoot on his head, Mr. Monster. Ah, after mumbling. You start following him, he knock on the door and after a few seconds an old woman opened the door. Woman, you want something my son? Jungkook, yeah, actually I want to buy this house. He say this in full of attitude. After listening his word, your jaw drop and eyes got wide open. Why you, what? He lost his mind? You mumble, woman, what are you saying son? Jungkook, I want to buy this old house. He looked toward the house and you hold his hand and make him look toward his eyes with full of anger. Why you? We need it only for one night and you want to buy this whole house? What will you do after it? Tell me. Just ask for help. You tell him in low voice so the lady did not listen to your talk. Jungkook, I am Jeon Jungkook and I never ask for help to anyone. You put your hand on your face because of frustration. Why you? Okay, take a side. Let me talk to her. You look toward the lady and bow to her. Why you? Auntie, we need a shelter into the into your house just for one night. And tomorrow morning we will leave from here. Can you just help us for one night, please? You say this into your sweet voice. She looked toward you with a smile. Woman, okay, my child, come inside. The woman entered to her house and you were following her. But suddenly he hold your wrist and made you look toward his angry eyes. 
Jungkook, why you never talk to me like this? The way you talking to this old lady, why you? Because she is sweet, not like you are coconut face. Now leave my hand. You enter to the house and leave him behind. Jungkook, what coconut face? She called me coconut. I will show you today, but be ready for your punishment. So he also entered to the house and looked toward you. The house was quite small, and the lady gave you a small room. He looked toward you. Jungkook, there is no bed where we will sleep. Why you? Oh, I'm sorry, Your Highness. We forget to take your royal bed from your big mansion. So tonight you will sleep into the floor. I hope you don't mind. You make a weird expression after saying this and start placing pillow onto the floor. Jungkook, what? Into the floor? We will sleeping into the floor? His eyes got wide open. Because he never sleep into the floor. Suddenly, the lady enter to the room and give you the tray of the food. Lady, I think you both will be hungry. Eat this. You smile and take the tray from her hand and sit into the floor. You start eating because you were hungry a lot, and he was still looking towards you. Jungkook, how you can eat this? It's not looking delicious at all. Why you? You did not try it and start assuming that it will be not good. Sit here and eat it. Jungkook, no, I will not. I am a human, not an animal. Just do eat you. I never want to try this. You look toward him with a frustration. Why you? So congratulations, Mr. Jungkook. You married to an animal right now. I am looking like an animal to you if I am eating this food. You hold his wrist and make him sit into the floor and make a bite of the food and lead toward his mouth. Why you open your mouth and eat it, Junko? But I don't think so. It's good for my health. Just leave it. You did not listen to him and put it into his mouth. Why you tell me how it tastes? He chewed the food for a few seconds and looked toward you, Junko. Good. Now feed me. You become shocked. Why you? What are you a kid that I will feed you? Jungkook, it's your punishment for calling me a coconut. Now feed me. Otherwise, your punishment will be rising, wife. Why you? No, I'm hungry. Eat by yourself. You make a bite of food and put it into your mouth. But before you will chew the food, he quickly hold your wrist and press his lips into yours and take the bite from your mouth to his. You become shocked on his sudden action, like so left from your body. He smirk on your reaction. Jungkook, wife, you did not like it. Why you? I will kill. Ah, you are such a shameless man, Jungkook. So finally, you know it. Now do it. Otherwise, I will enjoy to do it again. Now there is no other option left, and you start feeding him. He was enjoying to seeing you in frustration. After feeding him, you place a pillow into the floor and make a safe distance between both of you. Your dress was still wet, and you are drying yourself in front of the fire. But Auntie entered to the room and gave you a long gown, which cover your whole body. Auntie, take this and change your dress. Otherwise, you will catch the cold. You bow and take it. Thank you, Auntie. Jungkook was watching the whole scene after she left the room. You arrange the duvet into the robe and try to change it behind it. Jungkook, wear this in front of me. Your eyes got wide open. Why you? No, never, Jungkook. Now I'm your husband, and you have to follow me. And you did not tell me yet that you surrender yourself to me. Why you? For being surrendered, it doesn't mean that I will follow your every stupid order, Jungkook. You know, but it's not difficult for me to strip you. But I want you to strip yourself in front of me with your own hands. He was coming toward you, and you take few steps back, and soon your back hit to the wall, and he trap you into his arms. Jungkook, so now tell me where will you run, wife? He rubbed his tip of the nose on your face. Byun, Jungkook, please stop. Jake is smart. I want to listen this, please, but on the bed when I was hard, so hard that tear come out from your eyes and wound you under me. You close your eyes tightly and look toward him with anger and take deep breath. Why you? So, okay. I don't want to change. I am good in this. You remove his hand from the wall and lie into the floor and take the duvet and close your eyes. He smirk and bite his bottle lip and lie down beside you. Jungkook, let's see how you pass this night without me. 
he mumbled and closed his eyes but into the mid of the night you feel a cold like you're sleeping into the eyes you rub your hand and and try to warm yourself but it doesn't work you are shivering very badly and because of your voice he opened his eyes and looked toward you your face was pale your lips were shivering and the skin turning to white jungkook what happened you are not looking good he touched your forehead and you shrug his hand away why you leave me i'm fine jungkook you having a cold fever and you are telling me you are fine come here he removed the duvet from his side why you no never i did not need your help jungkook why you it's not a time for argue you need my help if you don't want then think you will be not make it into the morning my body is warmer than your come here Bayun I prefer to die before coming to you Jungkook and I don't want to make you die so easily if you are that much desperate then tell me I have a gun I will shoot you right now and you will be die tell me it's a good plan You look toward him in frustration and again start rubbing your hands Bayun no I'm fine I don't need any help from death in you he did not listen to you and more and hold your wrist and make you lie down with him he cover your body with duvet and take it off your wet clothes why you what are you doing leave me junko i don't care about it what are you thinking but my attention is very clear toward you so just shut up and let me do my job after taking off your dress and his shirt he hug you tightly and because of his warmness you close your eyes and snuggle your face into his chest and soon fall in sleep your hot breath was touching his chest he closed his eyes and smirk and cook control yourself if you lost your control she will die today because of you he bite his lower lip to control himself jungkook your touch is just like a magic on my body i never feel like this with anyone like i was feeling with you my bird he put his legs on your leg and make you more under him into his body and tighten his grip on your waist next morning he opened his eyes when he listened a chirping voice of the birds he opened his eyes and found you are still sleeping into his arms a unknown smile appear on his lips he tuck your hairs back to your ear to see your face clearly your red lips clear skin and the sun rays which was touching your smooth skin was making you more beautiful he was observing your every feature suddenly your hand touched his bare back which gave him a shiver into his spine He hold his breath for a second and you hug him more tightly and leave no space. This sleep a blanket slightly left from your chest so because of this your soft chest was touching his hard and bare chest. He was surprised because your every single touch was giving him a craving to touch you more. Your heartbeat was touching his neck but you are still lost into your deep sleep. You don't have any idea that from your touch someone is getting needy and plus crazy for you. Now he can't control himself anymore but your fragrance make him lost his mind. He snuggle his face into your neck and give you wet kisses on your neck. Your soft skin was making him more crazy. He start doing it little rough. into the deep sleep you also enjoying his touch on your body and did not realize it that it was not a dream but a real you hug him more tightly because of some how you are enjoying his touch on your body he intertwine his finger with your and hover over you his muscular body and your body was making the atmosphere more hotter He was snuggling his body more with your soft body which was giving him another type of pleasure his touch on your body was getting rough time to time and you are not even into your sense to stop him your heavy breath and his uneven breath was making him more needy he hold your tiny waist into his one arm and make your soft body touch to his hard body Because of this uneven movement a duvet got removed from your chest completely he touch your thighs with his one hand and with the other hand he intertwine his finger with your 
and his face was snuggled into your neck. He was giving you wet kisses on all over your chest. Then he moved toward your and snuggled his face under your chest and gave you kisses on it. Because of this much pleasure which was he giving to you, a small one left from your mouth by you. Your soft voice echo into his ear. A small smirk appeared on his lips. Now he is doing more roughly than before, slowly his hand going under to your thighs. Suddenly someone knocked on the door because of the loud noise, your eyes got wide open. Jungkook was still busy into his business which was your body. Your breath got hit for a second after seeing him hovering over you. But you gained your senses back and hit on his hand hardly. After feeling your hand on his back, he looked toward you. Jungkook, don't you dare to stop me. He looked toward you with his dark eyes. You was trying your best to push him away from your body, but suddenly he looked toward you with his dark eyes, which would make you scare from him, like he will kill you. Tear left from your eyes. Vayun, don't do this. Stay away from me. Otherwise, it will be not good for you. He was staring you with his dark eyes. Jungkook, Okay, then what will you do with me? Tell me. He writes his voice, which make you weak in front of him. You quickly cover your face with your both hands. Yun, please stop shouting. Jungkook smirk on your sudden action. He come closer to your face that you can feel his hot breath on your hands. Jungkook, move your hand away from your face. I want to see it. You did as he said to you and looked toward him with your teary eyes. Jungkook, wow, in fear you looking more beautiful. You looked toward him without blinking your eyes for a second. You both lost into each other's eyes. Suddenly someone again knocked on the door. He break the eye contact and look toward the door. He take deep breath and wear his shirt and look toward you. Jungkook, Where's your cloth? I'm going to opening the door. You nodded your head as yes. He walked toward the door and opened it. Auntie, someone is waiting for you on the door. He walked toward the main door and found his man. Guard, boss, everything is clear. We can leave for the mansion. He nodded his head and come inside the room. He opened the door and found you already wear your clothes. Jungkook, let's go wife, it's time to leave for your permanent cage. You did not say anything and walk with him. After a few minutes, you reach to the car and sit behind. He also sit with you and turn the car toward the mansion. Your eyes were full with tears. Cause now there is nowhere left for your freedom. After reach to the mansion, he take your hand and enter to the main door. Suddenly your eyes land toward Mrs. Jeon. You quickly leave Jungkook hand and hug Mrs. Jeon tightly. She plays her hand on your head and asks to Jungkook. Mrs. Jeon, what happened? Why are you crying? Jungkook smirk. Congratulations, mom. Your daughter-in-law is back to your house. Mrs. Jeon frown his brows. What? Daughter-in-law? Jungkook, yeah, yesterday night we take vowels and now she is my wife. Her eyes got wide open. Jungkook, so you both rub each other tears. I'm going to my room. After saying this, he walked toward his room and Mrs. Jeon take you to her room. Mrs. Jeon, tell me, Vayun, is this true? You nodded your head as yes. Mrs. Jeon, why you did this, Jungkook? Tear left from her eyes. You rub her tears and hold her hand. Mrs. Jeon, I'm sorry. I try my best to save you. Please forgive me. Vayun, it's okay. Don't cry, auntie. It's not your mistake. Mrs. Jeon, now I can't do anything. Vayun, you don't need to do anything. Now it's time that he will pay for his sins. Mrs. Jeon, what? But how? You rub your tears from your hand. Mrs. Jeon, I'm always with you. She plays her hand on your hand and smile. I'm not your auntie anymore. I'm your mom, just like him. You smile and hug her tightly. Vayun, thank you, mom. Mrs. Jeon, my lovely daughter, suddenly made knock on the door and you both look toward her. Maid, Mrs. Jungkook, master is calling you. You frowns your bros and look toward maid. Vayun, my name is Vayun. Call me with this name. 
she vowed to you again maid sorry it's master order to call you with this name you took deep breath and looked toward mrs jian mrs jian you go she is coming she bow and left the room mrs jian why you and go and take care of yourself you get up and walk toward his room you took deep breath and knock on the door but you receive no reply after some time you enter to the room and become surprised why you his room is so horrifying like him dark and no color just like a cave of a monster you mumble suddenly someone hold your wrist and pin your figure toward the wall you shout because of his sudden action why you ah your eyes got wide open after seeing his face so much closer to your why you what is wrong with you why you are looking me like this jungkook smirk nothing i just want to see my bride why you so you see me now leave my hand jungkook i want something from you he room her eyes around your body why you what he come closer to your ear and whisper jungkook kiss me on my lip your eyes got wide open why you no never now leave my hand go yesterday night you surrender yourself to me and you have to follow my orders i want you on me right now just do it why you why you always like this i want you kiss me i will kill you why can we just not talk to like normal people like talking to each other he took deep breath jungkook listen bud don't test my patience do it otherwise the consequences will be not good for you he looked toward you with his dark eyes why you i'm your wife and real man never force herself on his wife ever if you have a guts to win my heart like a man and if not you just want me then i'm here in front of you make me yours by your power he gritted his teeth and pick you up into the bridal style and throw you on the bed junko now you are testing my patient birds he take off his coat and remove his belt and open her shirt buttons and hover over you junko don't do this you can't force yourself on me Jungkook, you think I need your permission? Suddenly his eyes land on your neck and he kisses it, and it was biting more than sucking. Tear left from your eyes and you stop moving for a few seconds. When he did not feel your body is moving, he leave your neck and look toward your eyes. You are looking toward him with your tearful eyes. Why you complete your wish on me? You want me now? Then take it. I will never stop you. But just tell me one thing. Why are you doing this to me? There is a lot of girls outside who are ready to throw herself on you. Then why me? Tear was flowing down from your eyes. You were still under him. He looked toward your tear and kiss on it. You close your eyes and then he looked toward you. Jungkook, I'm obsessed for you. I just want you. A sad smile appear on your lips. Why you and one day when your obsession get over for me you will throw me to your guards and they will until i die right suddenly his eyes become dark like he will take out your soul he hold your hairs into his face and look toward you with his killing gaze painful groan left from your mouth ah jungkook you are not like other girl you are my wife and it's only my right on you till your last breath why you all the mans are same you just want a girl for yourself for your pleasure no one care about us what we want what we think nothing we are just a toy for you we born for you in this world for your pleasure but remember always i will never be your if you will love me from the bottom of your heart i will never be yours I swear I will always hate you from the bottom of my heart. He took deep breath and get up from you. Junko, get out from here. Otherwise I will be not hesitate to kill you. You get up and rub your tears and came out from his room. You now I will make you taste your own medicine. Just wait and watch. Now welcome to my hell. Jeon Jungkook.